welcome back. I hope you're all doing well today. And um, today we're going to continue on with our food signs and we're going to go ahead and jump into some vegetable signs. So we're going to do that today. And of course we will do our alphabet numbers one to 40 and then we'll get going on some signs. So let's get these signs warmed up. So let's go ahead and start with some finger wriggles, not forgetting those thumbs, wriggle them around and then some wrist circles outwards and some wrist circles inwards, lovely. And let's do this wiggly worm one, stretch those fingers out on our wrists. And the other way, nice. And let's do some explosions, warm them up a little bit more, lovely. And then let's do this one. Let's just press our fingers into our hand a little bit. And not forgetting our thumbs. We're gonna give your thumbs a little extra stretch there. And we're ready to go. Okay, so our alphabet first, we'll go through slowly and then fast afterwards as always. So here we go. A, B, C, D, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Nice. All right, so let's try that a little bit faster now. Here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Nice, good job. Awesome, so let's go through our numbers one to 40 and we'll do them slow and then we'll do them fast afterwards. So remembering that the back of our hand is facing the person we're signing to on numbers one to five. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, flip it around, six, seven, eight, nine, and thumbs up for 10. Flip it back around, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, Flip it around again, give it a shake. 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. 21, 22, 23, or 23, 24, 25, or 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. Here we go. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Awesome, so let's try that a little bit faster now. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 
23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 and 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Nice, good job. So our first sign is vegetable because that's what we're signing about. So for vegetable, we are gonna use our V sign from our alphabet because vegetable starts with the letter V. So we're gonna have this shape right here and then our index finger, we are gonna to touch that to the bottom of our cheek just like this. So we're gonna point it here and then we're gonna flip our hand around so our middle finger is touching our cheek instead. So vegetable vegetable. So all we're doing, starting with our V, index finger touches our cheek and then we flip it around. Vegetable. Vegetable. Nice. So our next sign is salad. So for salad, both of our hands are going to be working and we're going to flip them so the palms of our hand is facing upwards as if we're holding something in our hands. And then from here, we are just going to kind of move them in a circular motion inwards. It's as if we've got all of these different types of vegetables in our salad and we're mixing it all up and we're creating a lovely salad for ourselves. So salad, salad, salad. Nice. Our next sign is lettuce. So for lettuce, we are going to use our dominant hand and we're going to use this kind of heel part of our hand right here. And all we're going to do is we're going to flip it around and we are going to tap the side of our head twice with it. So lettuce 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 nice so next is onion and onions usually make people cry uh, if you are chopping them it definitely makes my eyes water if i'm chopping them so for this sign we are going to use this hand it's going to be in a fist but we're going to focus on our index finger so this is going to be kind of poking upwards a little bit like a little mountain then from here we're going to go to the corner of our eye and kind of twist it a little bit as if we've cut too many onions and our eyes are starting to water and um, we need to sort that out because our, our eyeliner might smudge or whatever is going on. So we just kind of twist it like that and that's the sign for onion. So we have different types of onion, so we might have red onion. So if you want to sign red onion, then we would do the color red, which we've learned. So we would sign red and then we do the sign for onion. Onion. So red, onion. Nice. We might have a yellow onion. So we would sign our yellow sign. So yellow and then onion, nice. And then if we had a white onion, we would sign white and then onion after it. So you have some options there. So onion is our sign and then you can add whatever color onion if you want to be more specific about what you're talking about. Our next sign is spinach and for spinach, we're gonna fingerspell this one because I like trying to get in some fingerspell words in where I can. So for spinach, we'll just go ahead and fingerspell that together. So we'll start with our S P I N A C H Spinach. Our next sign is carrot. And for carrot, this one's pretty literal. It reminds me of Bugs Bunny eating away at those carrots. So for this one, we're gonna have a hand in a fist or our S, and then we're gonna imagine that we have a carrot and then that we're eating it just like Bugs Bunny would. And um, we're just gonna chatter our teeth as if we're eating this carrot that's in our hands, just like this. And that's carrot. Carrot. Next is mushroom. So for mushroom, we're going to use both of our hands for this, and we're going to use our non-dominant hand as uh, the top of our mushroom. So we're just going to kind of have it in this umbrella-like shape, um, the top of the mushroom kind of shape as best you can. And then our dominant hand is going to have our index finger upwards just like this, and then we're going to place that underneath the top of our mushroom, and we're going to tap uh, the palm of our hand twice and that's mushroom mushroom nice so our next sign is corn um, I've actually seen two ways to sign corn so we'll go ahead and learn both of them so the first way that I've seen is we are going to use um, the same kind of thing that we did with carrot so when we did carrot we had our fist and we imagine we had our carrot here and then our teeth would chatter it away as if we were eating the carrot we're going to do the same kind of thing with corn however we are going to use our index finger like this and we're going to have it to the side so it's horizontal and then we're just going to 
kind of push it across um, our mouth like that. And then as we're doing that, our teeth are gonna be chattering again. So just like this. Corn. So you're just imagining that your finger's the corn and then you're just chomping away at that. So that's one way that you can do it. Another way that you can do it um, that I've seen is you use both fingers, uh, both index fingers, and then you bring them to each side of your mouth and then you kind of just twist them like that. Corn. Corn. So I've seen both ways do it. Um, so whichever way works for you, then that's great. And last but not least is broccoli. And I'm a big fan of broccoli. I know there's a lot of broccoli non-believers out there, but I'm a big fan. So broccoli, we are gonna start with our color broccoli. So we are gonna use our G for green, and then we're gonna shake it, and we're gonna sign green because broccoli is green. And then after that, we're gonna do our classifier for uh, broccoli. So we are going to make our hand into a fist, and then this hand is going to kind of turn into all of the, um, the flowery bit of the broccoli. So if you imagine this is kind of the, the tree trunk part of it, and then the rest of it is the kind of like the little branches that come off of it. So that's how we sign it. So we do the sign for green, and then we kind of try and make a broccoli as best we can with our hands. So broccoli, broccoli. Nice. All right, you guys. So those were our vegetable signs for the week. I hope you learned something new and enjoyed learning them. I sure did. So I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and a wonderful weekend and I will see you soon.